All right, so let's take a look at this together. Uh, so I'm going to create an integer array name nats for short. And it's going to be a new integer with size 20. Okay, so it's currently cr created and then memory has been allocated. However, it is an empty array. So I'm going to use a for loop with integer i starting from zero, condition is i less than 20, and increment is i plus plus. Okay, so, and then inside the loop, I'm gonna use the nats with index of i starting from zero, and then assign the value of i. All right, so, then I'm going to use the for loop again, same for loop basically. I mean, I should have, I could copy and paste. Okay, and then all I want to do is PL tab so I can print nets of i. Okay, so to compile, I need to say Java C net nums that Java and to run I need to say Java net nums. Alright, so I did my get result I did get my results. However, notice in the requirement I said all positive natural numbers, so that excludes zero. So which means that if I start from zero, I could add one to the first and then all the I values so that I can start my natural values from, from 1 to 20. Okay, that's better. So as the challenge, I said, can you uh, store the first 20 squares? So I'm going to just change, make a change on this. So instead of i plus 1, to make things e easy, I will also just use the i value and just i times i. So uh, that means that I'm gonna take i value zero times zero, store it to a nat zero, nat zero, and then the second iteration I'm gonna say one times one, store it in nat one, and the third I'm gonna say two times two, which is four, store it into nat two. So uh, with this, so we can go ahead and compile and then run to see how it will look like. So I start from zero square, one square, two square, three square, four square. So that's it.